Hello folks, I just wanted to share my interesting, wonderful experiences going on here. These, I don't know what they are, they just come up all of a sudden. Well, I had mixed my cream rinse with my bar soap, I don't know what it was, but it really had a really funny reaction. Because all these little hairy bugs embedded themselves into my stomach. And it started out with one big pupa. And see, they had long since been uh, abandoned. I got, and you know, when those were abandoned, poof, all these other ones popped up, you know, because they repopulated. These are fucking nasty little buggers. You know, and then, you know, psh, I am not making this shit up, you know. It's been a long battle. Anyways, my topic and my thing I want to share with everybody is my belly button pupa. Okay, there's my belly button. It has really taken on an odd little aura. You know, I just found out that the other side... Maybe a pupa too, this side. Because that sure does look like a fucking pupa. You know? So I got two nests that went and lived in my belly button. There's one pupa. But this fucker is really hard to pick. It's like cartilage or something. You can't pick through it and, oh, fuck. You don't need to pick through it. <laughs> Just leave it the fuck alone and try to get rid of it. I'm not picking it. I am trying to kill it. I'm using various things to try to get rid of this. Oh, so, um, let's get closer. Let's see if we can get in closer. Ooh, see, it's a nasty little pupa. I just hate it. And I've been trying castor oil on it because that's a natural um anti uh parasitic oil it helps get rid of them so that's what i'm using here and you know it's not i put bait i put castor oil on it right now so that's why it's all looking strange and stuff because it's just a little moist but isn't that some crazy shit and like i said i don't dare pick it I'm just keeping it clean, but as I'm trying to figure shit out, because doctors, doctors all tell me I'm nuts, you know, nothing we can do, they laughed at me, at Claire's, you know, because they just class, they put a classification on me, just bam, now that, I am sorry, but that isn't cancer, it's not smelly, I haven't been ill, but, you know, my belly button, right there. And it's just like all invaded. Yes. So, personally, I just, I don't know. I went to many, I went to three doctors, you know, and they just had nothing. Now, all they do is tell me to quit picking. I don't pick these things. You know, this thing right here is just evil. If you pick it, it grows back. It's a hairy little bug. It may look dried out, but I tell you, I'll get a picture, a video of it when, after I take a shower. It's just some crazy shit. I am not kidding, and it's alive. You know, that's all those little whatever they are. They're teeny tiny little things, parasites that all build themselves into one big thing and they protect themselves. It's just some crazy shit. So, and it is, it has been an awful ride. And like I said, I haven't picked these, not one bit, because it just makes it worse. It really does. I picked one of my first one that was my first big ginormous pupa. Look at that. 
I mean, it was all hard. And it was like cartilage and I don't know, you couldn't get through it. But see, now it has softened up quite a bit. And they have left the, abandoned this one. And then they moved up here and here. They just burrow in quick. It's just some crazy, crazy stuff. You know, and like I said, I just leave these the fuck alone. And this is an old puka. This is still hard. I'm just wondering if things still might be living in there. I don't know, but it's uh, not active. You know, it don't hurt. Nothing. It's all good. But it's just, it's just a freaky thing. That's all. I wish somebody could help me. My poor belly button. Look at that miserable little guy. Just looks, I don't know. Looks like he's not having a good time there. Okay, over and out.